Hello, my name is Garx82, and welcome back to our Greg Tech New Horizons. Nope, Divine Journey 2 uh, playthrough. Man, I was just playing Greg Tech earlier. All right, uh, I am trying to, not trying to, I am uh, setting up a recipe for the recharge pedestal. I'm putting it in the knowledge core. Unfortunately, you do need all of the items now it does seem like whenever i try to craft using the arcane inscriber it crashes the world i broke them and replaced them maybe that will stop that from happening but i don't want to i'm not going to do it intentionally uh we'll just obviously use that or we could use our regular Thing. Yeah, there definitely feels these arcane things and it pops up thomic energistics is uh, When it says like what the the crash is related to so it's something to do with that. I don't know um, But we are doing this. I don't remember what goes into the V resonator actually All oh, right, yeah, those reduction cores. I remember those cores. Is it uh, it is on there I will Maybe, uh, I don't know how many of these we're actually going to need in the future. Probably a lot. Oh man, those morphic resonators. I remember crafting these up. But usually I would just do, you know, it would dump the stuff in there and I would just craft it up manually. Uh, but it definitely is something that uh, I'm going to add to the knowledge core. Um, if I change my mind, I can always, you know remove the item anyway or replace it with something uh, i really should uh get like fully automate everything that goes into the knowledge cores and the arcane assemblers so if i want to i can just click a button i don't have to like manually put this stuff uh i should do that um yeah, we should do the cores first. Although I did notice we had one in the A system. I don't remember crafting up an extra one. Did we get that from a quest? We may have gotten that from a quest. Um, but yeah, let me do, we'll do this. Nope. There we go. So in the future, we will have that if we need it. Did I switch them around? No. I when I broke it, I there we go. I forgot to put the things in. It does that automatically if you shift click it in. That's probably what I forgot to do there. All right, all right, V resonator. There we go. And then is it the wand? Wand. Recharge pedestal. I don't know if we're going to need more of these. Uh, if we. Oh, duh. I need to put. I actually need to put this in the thing. I love that sound effect. I know I say that like every time, but every time I hear it, I love it. What is it? Recharge. All right. Recharge pedestal. Get that, and then I need the void recharge pedestal. All right, so three Eldritch stones. If I could type. All right, cool, so there is that. And then it looks like we have most of this for the recharge pedestal. All right, cool. And then one thing, I wish you could stop it or like let it show which one it's doing. I need to get more of these. That's probably something I need to get today as well. Maybe I'll craft up some, what are they? Not crucibles, uh, cal cauldron. Maybe like, I don't know, three more of them. It's just iron. I keep thinking it's wand recharge pedestal. Is that what it's called in Greg Tech New Horizons? I don't know why. I keep thinking it's like a wand 
recharge by saw. Also, I have no idea why I'm getting all these crafting things <laughs> since we updated the pack. Uh, the Impetus Crystal, I th think, isn't this? I need to do... Yes, Primordial Fragments. And I need to repair the things. That's right. Did I craft these up before I wrapped up last episode? I didn't. Probably because we're missing something, as we can see. We're missing a few things. I have no idea where that comes from. Ugh, I'm with all. Redstone. Uh oh. Gold. <laughs> uh oh. All right. Uh, we got. Uh, I got some stuff I need to do. Have we got redstone yet? We do. All right. So I need to make a recipe for that. And those abyssal craft, that stones and stuff, is there? Let me just do this really quick. All right, that should have sorted that. Like, um, um, almost all. Ah, uh, the loot fabricator, that's right. We're, we're getting there. I don't know how far away it is. Um... It's at least after Astral Sorcery, which is coming up here, to be honest. Chapter 23, we are on 21. So it, that is getting closer. Okay, uh, let me get this up and then... Could probably use another gold seed, to be honest. A couple of them. I have just crafted, like, the one just to start out with, and then if we need more, I'll add them, like I did with the Platinum, uh, just to speed it up. Even just one other seed, it, like, doubles the rate we are getting gold. So, all right, let me uh, craft this up, and we will come back. Okay, we are back. I've crafted up uh, five of the poppets. I did go and farm up the Amethal stuff um i may do a, a spawner uh, if we need a lot more of those which we probably will uh so i'll probably do a spawner for the the that flesh but uh yeah so i've got a few of these in this sh i'm pretty sure it only does like one yeah it's uh They're expensive. So, I mean, I'm pretty sure you're, like, supposed to, um, you're probably supposed to automate, automate the repairing of those. I just haven't done it yet. All right. Um, is this a, I don't remember. Is this, this is just a regular ref to be. I think I'll actually just put it in the molecular assembler because I don't have the primordial fragments done. So if I don't have any, it's not going to use up the thing. I'm assuming the last one, the last like durability, it will destroy the primordial fragment. Uh, that's why I am have like kind of kept them. I don't know if there's like one more there or or what. I do have three of them. I just was I'm being a little careful with that. All right, let's do that. Let's do. Wait, did it craft it up? No. Did I thought that said it? It crafted it up for a second. Uh oh. Does it not fit in? It should fit in there. All right. Oh, I prob maybe I need to. I probably need to switch that recipe. 
I got a little ahead of myself there. This probably needs to be changed into a, yeah, a crafting table recipe. Ah, there. Usually if it's stuck, that is either it can't input the stuff or it is the wrong type of recipe. Trying to remember where all these recipes go, to be honest. Now that we're kind of switching over. That's right. Actually, it looks like it's done. All right. Um, now, I just need to make sure I have everything we need in here, which it does not look like we do. Uh, that, we have Alienus. Pretty sure we have Orum. I think we have all that stuff. I just don't have enough, would be my guess. Which... We really should have, like, every single one in here. And it should be complete. Actually, I don't think we have mach Machina. Machina, however you say it. Thought I did, actually. No, it looks like we didn't do that one. All right. Whoops. Let's do... I think I have one free one. Oh, nope, I don't. Oh, I do. I just don't have enough in there. All right. I thought I had added that to the, the thing. Still think I should do something with these crystals. Like, oh, that's going to take a while. <laughs> Let me do this. Uh, just because this has 20 Cognito, it has 10 Examinus, so that is 35 Essence it needs to pull out, so it's going to take a while to go through that. Um, I do have two Smelters. We could get more, which would probably help. Just more of everything, really. But... Uh, yeah, our void metal is, not gonna lie, void metal is slightly annoying to craft up because you need the cold essence, the uh, cold void meted, and then the fire young it. So yeah, that's kind of why I haven't gone crazy with that. Okay, so that needs to fill up. All right, let me continue crafting this up. And then, did I see Orum over there? I don't think I did see Orum. Oh, yeah, I do. All right. I think I was preparing to craft this up. I just haven't, uh, I didn't have enough mash, you know. All right. There we go. The void recharge pedestal. That should be a, a ding. Yeah, it looks like it is. What does this give us? Condensed alienus. Take it. Okay. I'm not sure. I have a feeling we're going to have to go that way. Warning, do not autocraft, yeah. Insert it, make sure it has an, yeah. Okay, so that's just like our the typical stuff. I would have to do an, uh, a crafter to do that. Um, I'm not sure if we need that. All right, I do have some void things. I crafted up extra, so need five okay we do have enough it looks like for that we have a bowline Man, what a random recipe we do but uh actually i think i could probably repair that I'll chuck it in the thing and then we will go check to see if we actually need it. I don't know if you can just throw the the thing down, the pedestal, and it'll automatically go, or do you actually have to 
route it. Okay, I've just gone ahead and crafted up, or I'm going to craft up the those other items because I figure we'll probably need them. Uh, by the way, this still crashes if you try to uh, craft on it. So uh, I just gotta remember not to <laughs> not to do that. All right, so there we go. I'll read that in a second. I don't know if you like need this or you just put it next to the the thing, but uh we'll go try it out. Arcane Terraformer. I don't know if we need that. I it makes me kind of nervous that it's it does that. I don't know if it's like that. It was, maybe it's that. I was for some reason I was thinking it was that, but I think it's actually craft up this, craft up that, then that, then that, whatever that is. I have no idea what that is. Uh, we're working on this one though, so I think we're good. I think the other stuff, the other items, maybe we needed for that next part. Hey Fox. Now, where's the thing? Here it is. Okay. So uh, we drainer. Really? I believe we put the drainer down. Thought it was doing something for a second, but I think that's just the the thing. That uh, I did hear you have to like do that. All right, I think I think it's working. I'm guessing <laughs> it's working. Uh, this. Oh, we got we got beams. Everyone, we got ourselves some beams. All right. Is that kind of. I will say that looks pretty cool. Okay, that made me jump because I have headset on and that was really loud. <laughs> uh, we got up to very weak. Am I going to have to just keep doing void things? What do I... I taint poison. Oh, it's tainted soil. Is that going to... Is that going to spread? Should I be worried about that? <laughs> uh, I did kind of go a little ways away from the base, but I'm not like super far away from the base. Here's my shovel. Well, that's horribly slow. Uh, I'll worry about that in a second. Yeah. All right. I... Yeah, I guess we'll have to... Man, is there... Am I just going to have to keep spawning void rifts, I guess? Maybe? I thought there was a way to... Is there like a way to stabilize a rift or something like that? I feel like that was a thing somewhere. Okay, so I was just looking through the Thaumonomicon, and I remember seeing something. I was like, oh, there is a stabilization thing. So, uh... We point it at the rift, and it does something with the uh, RF. And uh, so I went to craft it up, and I noticed we had two of them in our A system. I have no idea where they came from. It must be from a quest or something like that. Um, but I went to make recipes, and uh, yeah, apparently we already have some in our E system. It might have been a quest from a long time ago. Uh, when we originally opened up the the void rift. All right, so I guess we'll just have to dump more cobble in here. I don't want to like. I want to. I don't know if it's gonna like <laughs> form right on this stuff, but you know what? I'm gonna break that just in case. I don't I just don't know if it's gonna like void it. 
Uh, turn off my magnet. Turn off my magnet. Alright, that should probably form a rift. Maybe we need one more. Man, I'm getting short on cobblestone. Uh, we do have the essence seeds if I need, though. Okay, that should form a rift somewhere. Where's the... I Is it this one that... Uh... Yeah, we got some... Um... We got some flux in <laughs> the atmosphere. All right, there we go. It uh, it drops down, I think. Doesn't it drop down when a rift forms? All right. That literally, like... That spawned right where I had those, those blocks. I think that would have voided those. Didn't I have it? I had it, like, sitting, like, right here, didn't I? Or, like, right there? All right, anyway... Uh, so we need to point something. What does this look like? Oh, okay. It goes like that. I thought it was gonna, I thought it would have been facing up and I was gonna have to rotate it, but okay. So it says to, what do we think? We probably think that is the, where's my, my wrench? Uh oh, what did I do with my wrench? Uh oh, I can't find it. It's the the one you rotate. Oh no, what's it called? The wrench, the multi something wrench. Oh no, I don't remember what the name of it is. <laughs> multi tool or. Oh god. Crescent. No, multi. Oh, what's the name of that tool? Alright, it's the Morphe tool. It was in my inventory. It just changed. I don't like when it just automatically changes. I like to keep it on one and then change it if needed. Alright. Uh, you might be able to do that with a wrench of some sort, but it doesn't want to work that way. Really? I'm assuming this is the way we need to face it. I have no idea how far away it needs to be either. Right? I feel like that... Those red little dots is where you input the power. Yeah. Alright, cool. That already has a thing in there. Is it, is it doing anything? Do you work it? I thought it would maybe... Change the. I thought it would maybe change the look, but yeah, it seems to be working. All right. So that. 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 If right click, right click. That's pretty typical of. Yeah, it seems to be like. Shrinking again. Right, that is up to weak, though. Does this maybe this doesn't do what I think it's going to do? <laughs> maybe I'm uh, mistaken. It did shoot out a beam, though, didn't it? All right. I thought that would. I thought it said it would stabilize it. Uh, do 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 do. It fires a beam, which creates a. Containment field of sorts. The amber is a key component here. By, by I can use it to trap a flux rift in a field of stabilized energy, which will cause it to rapidly gain ability without the flux problem that a normal stabilizer creates. So are you are you working? Is it uh, not doing what I think it's going to do? That could also be a thing. Yeah, it's like, that didn't do anything. <laughs> Alright, at least that time it didn't make me jump. Alright, 
I feel like there, uh, there's got to be like a better way to do this than just dumping cobblestone in a cauldron to spawn rifts um, to feed this. So I definitely feel like I'm missing something. All right, let's try this again. Also, I put the chunks on. I didn't realize I'd placed this down on. I was thinking that was more in the chunk. Um, also, I noticed the the tainted soil is gone. Also, porous stone. That that new? I think that's new. Um, okay, uh, let's do this. Also, it does say in the thing the more you add. Facing it, the faster it goes. Okay, I feel like I am, like, not crazy. Like, it does appear to be doing something. But then it just kind of fades. Uh, let's do... Ah. I really need to do the infinite card, too. That is... Another thing I need to craft up. It's on the... Do list. I'm pretty sure that is infinite range. If I remember correctly. I'm just trying to figure out what direction we should face this. Not gonna lie, that made me jump a little bit too. <laughs> I'm very jumpy today, apparently. Void rifts just make me nervous. I think that's what it is. All right, so now they're both on it. Also, I really want that angel ring. For that. There, right there. Right click. All right, let's turn that off. Do we need to, like, turn these on and off with, like, a lever, which I don't have in my inventory? I don't have a recipe for levers. That's kind of funny. I guess it's just one of those things we haven't really needed that much of. I am kind of curious how, okay, it's about, yeah, right about there. It does say you can turn it on and off, so there's off. No. Does this just not do what I think it does? It's... I'm not, there is no like visual cue, so. I, doesn't it usually, <laughs> doesn't it usually face the way I'm placing it down? All right, so there it's going again. You getting bigger? I can't tell. I do like that kind of animation right there, though. No, see, that's like, it's just, okay, these don't do anything what I thought they would do. Is it supposed to be underneath it? On top of it? What does it do? Can I dump stuff into it to recharge it? <laughs> I don't remember. 
Take my stuff. Bro! Bro! Okay, so doing a little bit of Googling and uh, I figured out, first of all, these things overheat. So that is what is happening. It does say that in the uh, the thing. I just didn't realize it was that quickly because um, it does say it, it, if you leave it on an extended period of time. I didn't realize an extended period of time was like three seconds. <laughs> so, uh, yeah. So there you go. And then you can start seeing the things and it'll gradually fade. And then it takes a minute to cool down. So obviously you set up like some automation to turn them on and off. Um, and now, um, this also, the drainer also accepts a, a red sun signal to turn on and off. And I thought these were going to kind of like make that grow. I was kind of thinking it was going to be like the node. You know how like they used to, you convert the node into into V or whatever it used to be called in uh, Thumbcraft 4. I was thinking it was going to be more like that. It would make that grow. But I'm wondering if now... Now, even with that running, it's draining the void. All right. So that is... <laughs> that is not at all what I thought was going to happen with these. What the heck do these do? <laughs> uh, all right. Well, we got up to medium, but I'm assuming I need to fill like 12 of these. So there's obviously, I'm obviously missing something here. Um, there's, there's gotta be a way to fix that void thing. And unfortunately I'm just not getting a whole bunch of I'm trying to search is not really not really helping here um is it do i need to like upgrade this the drainer i do remember seeing something yeah, item drainer no i thought that was like the upgraded version i did see something about draining and i th thought Yeah, charged and nodes, resonator, drainer. Void siphon, you place a piece of void mail on top of draws in normal. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, okay, so we know that. <laughs> uh, Therefore, to send energy out, yeah. Oh, wait, impetus diffuser. This device can be seen as the inverse since it takes, no. No, I don't want to take the impetus, all right. Hmm. All right, let me do a little bit more research here. Because, yeah, this this is going to be terrible if I'm just doing all this manually. Okay, do I just keep feeding? Like, flux into the thing, and does it grow if I do that? Uh, also, I crafted up this extra dimensional monitor. I don't know if I mentioned that. Uh, so we can... Do something. I thought that would kind of give us more like numbers, um, but it shows the size of it and then how strong it is, I think. Um, so I dumped a few stacks of spruce wood. Spruce has 20 and it's really easy to craft up. So that's just dumping a ton of these stuff in the Asus, uh, the world. So hopefully. Maybe that will let it grow. All right. All 
Let's see if that... I do feel like it's bigger than it was before. Like, I do feel like we're getting more out of it than we were the first time we did it. All right. So that definitely shrank. Let me uh, continue. Let me continue doing it. I have no idea. Like, okay. So it shows me the rift that I can see right there. <laughs> what is the point of this thing? Okay, so doing that is definitely making this bigger, but uh, no clue what this does. Like, none at all. <laughs> I can't tell. I haven't noticed one difference when I had two of them going and I was doing it manually. I have no clue. But uh, yeah, just dumping more flux in. The chunk seems to be working. Yeah, because we had it down to about that size, and then it continues to grow. All right. So just a thin little sliver. What do you do? <laughs> what does it do? I have no idea. All right. Are we maximum yet? No. Still it's strong. Man, this is a pain. I'm obviously missing something. All right. Well, anyway, I'm going to do, do some more Googling and see if I can find out how the heck this works. Fortunately, it's like, you know, you can read all this stuff, but it's like not super clear unless I'm totally missing something. Um, how to because there's like there's like impetus generators too like there's a generator so how would how would you have a generator if the the rift keeps closing like that would be insane so obviously i'm doing something wrong here um but uh yeah i'll continue to try to figure this out and we'll charge up this thing because i have a feeling once we do this this recipe, it's going to like fully drain that. And I'm going to have to do that 11 more times. So, yeah. Not entirely sure. Anyway, that's going to be it for today. So thanks for watching and have a good one.